Hello everyone, so today I'm going to show you my natural hair routine. I'm starting off by soaking my hair in water. I'm around a 4B, 4C range. Like many other naturals, my curl pattern isn't necessarily consistent everywhere. I'm going in with my cannabis sativa lush length conditioner. This does not contain any sort of THC or CBD to those wondering. I'm going to section my hair into four sections. I'm using my scrunchies that I got off of Amazon, which I absolutely love. As you can see, I don't like to tie up my hair too tight, especially since my hair is wet and it's at a very vulnerable state, which means breakage can occur quite easily. I'm starting off with my first section. I like to kind of gently run my fingers through it. I'm going in with my conditioner. I'm coating my strands. That's my conditioner, which this stuff doesn't smell good. It just works really good in my hair. To me, it just, it smells a little potent. Very, very different smell. I tend to like things that are a little bit more flowery, I guess you can say, or I don't know, I just like things that smell good. I feel like this one just doesn't necessarily smell that great. Anyway, I'm going in with my wide tooth comb. I'm starting at the ends and working my way up. I do try to be gentle, just taking my time. Then I go in with a two strand twist. Please ignore my faces. I know I'm kind of looking a little crazy right now. <laughs> Then I'm moving on with the next section, repeating the same process, except this section is much more stubborn. The back of my hair tends to tangle a lot more than the front. As you can see, I got my product. Here is me just going and repeating the process. For each section I detangle, I like to go with a two strand twist.
And you guys, please ignore my face in the last part. <laughs> I know I'm looking a little crazy. <laughs> We're not going to talk about that though. <laughs> So now that I'm out of the shower, I'm going to move on with my styling process. I'm going in with some water. I absolutely love this spray bottle. I got it off of Amazon. I can leave a link down below for you guys. I'm starting off with my Trader Joe's hair serum, which I absolutely love. It's only $2.99 and it really works quite well especially when untwisting my hair. I like to be gentle, take my time. I like this curl enhancer because it doesn't contain parabens or silicones or anything like that. Also, it doesn't have alcohol in it, so it doesn't dry my hair as much as other ones. As you can see, I'm just coating the hair gel in my hair. Ta-da! One section. Done. Going in with the spray bottle. I love how it mists. It evenly distributes the water really well. 10 out of 10 would recommend. I'm repeating the process with hair serum to a twist. I highly recommend going in with an oil or a serum when untwisting your hair. It will avoid potential frizz and breakage. As you can see right now, I'm separating my curls. I do this because each individual strand likes to give each other a hug and that causes tangles. So I try to be very gentle and separate my curls. repeating the process. I like to try to take my time, but I am guilty of rushing this process and let me tell you, it does not turn out as nice. I 
I do get shrinkage just like many other naturals, which is a sign of healthy hair. I tend to like to try to elongate my hair without using heat, of course, using styling gels, doing twists, braid outs, etc. Here are the final results. I'm really happy. I like the way it turned out. Thank you everyone who watched this video. If you liked it, please consider subscribing. I plan on making more videos. I really want to try flexi rods. See how that works. I've seen so many videos of them. Please be nice in the comment section and just try to be a nice person in general. Thank you so much.